Hello everybody and welcome back to the Zeus Daz and Emulated Retro Game Channel. I go by the name of Zeus and I have another shit game time video review for you. This is on the Amiga and it's called Archura. Never heard of it back in the day, glad I didn't. It looks cheap as fuck and looks nasty too. Came out in 1989 and it was published by Arcadia. Also Gremlin, as in Gremlin that did Lotus. So is this a full price game, Arcadia, or was that a Master, Arcadia Mastronic, yeah that's a budget title, maybe it's obviously a budget um, department of, Krem, uh, of Gremlin. And who was it, uh, let's have a look, let's see if I can find anything on the poo grammars. Can't find anything apart from Ben Daglish, Ben Daglish, or Daglish, Ben Daglish, I think that's his name. Anyway, he did music. And the tune isn't too bad. I've heard worse. But I've heard a lot better as well. So, what can we say about this game and what is it about? Let's have a look. Right, the feeble instructions I have got is thus. You are a Chura, son of the Pendragon. Um, it's very hard to read this because the print doesn't look very good. Uh, the stem of the something invaders, you must write the petty king... See all that. Unite the petty kingdoms of Albion under your leadership. Yeah, you must do this. To do this, you need to find the secret treasures of Albion. Hidden, uh, hidden when the eagles came. Only Mer is that Mervyn or Merlin knows where, but he has vanished. Your only clue is that. I'm sorry, I can't read this because the, the, the instructions look like it's been written in. in Photocopied in uh, um, ink, but photocopied about five times. Um, your evil half sister, your, uh, I don't know, has kidnapped something. Uh, you must find. I might as well just go blah 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 blah. Get the thingy of the uh, what do you call it of the um, doodah. Yeah. To travel to a more strong, you must use the mystical wheel of Krem of Kremadon. You must then fight your way through. Uh, more Goose's own. Let's see, by finding and using the ruin stones. Oh, yeah, I know, you've got to get all those ruin stones, these little grey slab things, which you can see in the middle, uh, bottom middle screen. Uh, it's it, the place, it, it's Albion, it's in the 5th century. One of the bollocks. So that makes sense, doesn't it? I mean, that was pretty easy to follow, wasn't it? It's obvious what we've got to do there. We now we have some bloody instructions, which you can see properly. Right, uh, anyway. So this is you, and you've got a huge energy bar in the middle of the screen, it's like a dragon, it's a red dragon thing. That way, I can go that way, go through doors, uh, this reminds me of, um, I tell you what, this reminds me, same thing as Batman, not the movie game, oh there's one already, Batman the, uh, hey what happened there? Oh, I've gone down the truck, I was going to get that ruin. Yeah, there was two Batman games on the movie. There was the movie and there was uh, the Cape Crusader. Reminds me of that. Let's put me down. So I'm dead. I'm down this pit. I got stuck. And I can't get out of it. Well, that's good, isn't it? I am stuck in this pit. Oh, well, we have to press escape. And start again. <laughs> Attempt that again. Now, where did I fall out this time? I'm going to just keep jumping. Yeah, there we go. Just keep jumping. There we go. You can shoot these. Right. Just aimlessly wandering around these areas for ages. Now I I have no idea where I'm going. It's just guesswork. Oh, 
and there's a dragon in the bottom seat in the middle that's red. And your energy's red. And it'll go down gradually as um well, what the bloody hell's that? Looks like a king rat. Can I kill it? Yes, I can kill it. Was I supposed to? <laughs> I don't know. I've killed it. God, there were so many cheap looking crappy games, weren't there, that came out on the Amiga and ST. Really bad. through there already. Uh, die. This door. This is just guesswork for me. I don't know where I'm going. I really don't. I'm going around in bloody circles. Okay, we're outside. Oh, my energy's being really drained there. So you got, oh, there's another one. Oh, no, I'm just going to keep jumping in case I fall down a fucking pit. a bit of luck. Full energy again. That's very useful. For real. Okay. Oh, another ruin. Got the ruin, thank you. He's just aimlessly going round. Trying to locate these slabby stones. All stony slabs work to take your fancy. Anyway. Oh, there's another one. Oh, I can't get down to it. I've got to go right round, haven't I? Oh. That's a lot of ruins you got to get. Bloody circles now. Jump. 
I don't think you're going to get much fun out of this game. To be honest with you. This looks boring and it feels boring and I've been that way because I've got the candle from there. There's nothing there. Back through there. Go out this way. And I'm back round by the tree again. going around the bloody circles here. I hate games like this. I where the hell I'm going? No, oh, I'm dead anyway. That's it. That's it. There's only one thing to put in, isn't there, really? Well, that's shit. Shit! It's boring. It's boring. You just aimlessly go around, you've got to collect so many of these ruins. Unless you draw a map, then you might have a chance, but yeah. Uh, let's see if it's the same in the same place, because it's the same room. Yeah, there we go. So you fall down this pit if you don't jump. Like thus. Boom. And now you're trapped. Can't get out. That's it. You have to quit the game. You can shoot the rats though, that's something. But you can't get out of the game. You are stuck forever. Escape. So, yes. Look back through the dark mirror of the seasons to a time when the eagles deserted this land of Albion to the ravaging of the Saxons. Look back to an age of bloody war and mysterious magics. Magics with a bloody CK, yes. You are true, a son of the pen or whatever dragon. Stem the tide of invaders, you must unite the petty kingdoms of Albion Petty. What about pretty? Under your leadership as whatever. To do this, you need to find this, uh, the sacred treasures of Albion, yeah. Hidden when the eagles came, yeah. Mervyn knows where, but he has vanished. Alright, okay, so it's any of the... I didn't realise that because the instructions I got were printed. Travel to blah blah blah, fight your way through uh, to Sigmund to find using the ruined stone stolen by Morgan. You can travel so again to. It uh, just sounds crap because it is crap. It's like. So this is a kind of Lord of the Rings, Rastani f uh, fictional fantasy thing which. Can't be fucked about. It's just yeah, you're aimlessly going round doors. There's only so much you can do. I did a Commodore 6. What is that? I did a Commodore 64 game of it like this. The character moved around a thousand miles an hour, and um, going through doors and the enemies kept spawning. It was so fucking stupid. What is this? A king rat? Oh, they kill me off. King of the rats. So that's energy. There you go. Those candles are energies. Of trench, though, doesn't it? it? Possibly is. Uh, so, what we 
go ahead and points. God, I'm falling asleep literally playing this game. I really am. This is boring. I mean, it's... It's boring. I literally am falling to sleep playing this game. And I've got to stop now. Because, um... Otherwise, I'm going to fall into a coma. Let's over here. Let's see if there's anything interesting on the next screen. No, more doors. More boring doors. We're outside again. We did that before. And let me guess, it's the room you fall through. And you fall to your death. Wee! Boom! Boom! There we go. That'll do me. It's boring. Pointless and utterly boring. You know, tells you to do this, tells you to do that, a story of the past, and who gives a fuck? This game is boring. Um, crap. Definitely a budget title. No way it was a full price 19 or £24 grand title. No way. So, um, music, I said, it's not too bad, but apart from that, it doesn't look like anybody wanted to put their name and signature on this game. I can't find anything about it, about any of the programmers. So, yeah, I'm done with it. Archer on the Amiga 500, probably out on the ST as well. I haven't checked and I can't be fucked. So, let me know what you think about this, uh, this particular game in the comments. Let me see for myself what, um, what you make of it. What am I going to give it on the shitometer? Well, no doubt about it, it's going to get a one fat runny. Can't be bored to even do a poo. <laughs> 77 shits on the shitometer for Archer on the Amiga. So, yeah, another nice pick, Ray. Well done. Very obscure, boring, forgotten about game, and a relevant game brought back to 2022 for a little bit of relevance. That's it. Who the fuck remembers this game? Seriously. I bloody well don't. Went through my radar. Um, yeah, crap. Who gives a fuck about this game? I don't. Straight into the bloody bowl of shitness. Quite bloody right to. Alright, thank you very much again for joining me in this edition of Shit Game Time. If you would like to request a game on the Shit, uh, on the shit Game Secrets or series, There'll be a thumbnail pop up in a minute, top left as usual. Just click that and name the game to be shamed and leave the rest to me. Treat yourself. Think of a game that you think shit when you hate it. Let me flush it down the poop tube. That's my job. Okay, thank you again for, uh, for joining me on this edition of Shit Game Time. As I said, please leave your comments below and let me know what you think about this fucking war fest. Until next time, take care of yourselves. Zeus. Out of Plopsville.